ever pondered about the mysteries that lie beneath the ocean surface? What creatures lurk in the deepest unexplored parts of our planet? Welcome, dear listener, to a journey that takes us far beyond the familiar, into the uncharted depths of our vast oceans. Our planet is covered by more than 70% water, with the deepest parts of the ocean reaching nearly 7 miles below the surface. To put that into perspective, if you were to drop Mount Everest into the Mariana Trench, its peak would still be over a mile underwater. While you and I go about our daily lives, there is an entirely different world beneath the waves, a world that remains largely unexplored and unknown. From the sunlit surface waters teeming with life we journey into the twilight zone, where light starts to fade and darkness begins to take hold. Creatures here have adapted to the dwindling light, developing large eyes to capture every possible photon. But we're going deeper still, into the midnight zone, where eternal darkness reigns. Here the pressure is a crushing thousand times greater than at sea level, and the temperatures hover just above freezing. In this hostile world life takes on forms that might seem alien to us. Creatures have evolved in extraordinary ways to survive, many glowing with their own light in a phenomenon known as bioluminescence. This is not the realm of the ordinary. It is a world of the exceptional, the extraordinary, and the downright bizarre. The abyss holds secrets that we are just beginning to uncover. Each dive, each probe sent into the depths returns with new discoveries, revealing creatures so strange and fantastic they defy our wildest imaginations. We are on the brink of exploring a world that's been hidden from our eyes, a world where the boundaries of life as we know it are constantly being redefined. Today we're diving into the top 5 most fascinating creatures discovered in the ocean's darkest depths. So sit back, and let the mysteries of the deep unfold before your ears. Starting our countdown at number 5 we have the fang tooth fish, a creature as menacing as its name suggests. fang tooth fish typically live for about 5 to 10 years. These formidable creatures inhabit the deepest parts of the ocean, residing at depths ranging from 200 to 5,000 meters below the surface. It is relatively small, measuring around 15 to 18 centimeters in length. Give you an idea, they are some of the size to a medium-sized banana or an adult hand. And two fish have a ferocious appetite. They are opportunistic predators, eating raw smaller fish squid, and crustaceans found in their deep sea habitat. The sharp fang-like teeth help them capture and consume their prey. When threatened, fang to fish rely on their sharp teeth and agility to defend themselves. It can swiftly maneuver through the water, escaping potential predators. They have unique adaptations that allow them to survive in extreme deep sea conditions. The fang to fish, or Anoplogaster cornuta, as it's known in the scientific community, is one of the deepest living fish species in the ocean. It's been found at depths of up to 5,000 meters. That's more than three miles below the surface of the sea. Now let's talk about what makes this creature so unique. The most noticeable feature of the fang tooth fish is, of course, its teeth. It's got the largest teeth of any fish in the ocean proportional to its body size. These teeth are so long that the fang tooth fish can't even close its mouth properly. But don't worry, it's no threat to humans. This fish is barely six inches long, and those terrifying teeth are used to catch small fish and shrimp. The fang tooth fish also has a very distinctive body shape. It's dark, almost black, with a body that's been described as tuna-like. It has large, wing-like pectoral fins and a short, double-keeled tail. But despite its fearsome appearance, the fang tooth fish is relatively harmless. And here's an interesting fact. The fang tooth fish has a unique adaptation that helps it survive in the extreme conditions of the deep ocean. It's the Midnight Zone's most voracious fish. Hunters illuminate themselves and, by doing so, attract inquisitive prey. This is Fang Tooth. It has the largest teeth for its size of any fish. There are precious sensors all over its head and body, which can detect anything moving in the surrounding water. It's 
the Midnight Zone's most voracious fish. But prey used light as a distraction. A decoy of luminous ink. It has a kind of internal pressure system that matches the external pressure of the water. This allows it to withstand the crushing pressure of the deep sea, which can be up to a thousand times greater than at sea level. The fang fish is a true testament to the adaptability and resilience of life under the sea. It's a creature that thrives in conditions that would be fatal to most other forms of life. It's a creature of the deep, a creature of mystery, a creature of fangs. With the pressure at these depths, it's a wonder how these creatures survive. But wait, the journey has just begun. At number four, we meet a rather peculiar creature, the Dumbo Octopus. This curious cephalopod, named for its ear-like fins reminiscent of Disney's adorable elephant, is one of the most appealing sights in the deep sea. With a body that can grow up to a foot in length and a mantle that inflates like a parachute, the Dumbo Octopus is a master of deep sea navigation. The Dumbo Octopus is one of the cutest little creatures in the sea, and as you can imagine, its name originates from its resemblance to Dumbo, due to its prominent ear-like fins that help move through the water and navigate through the ocean currents. Dumbo octopuses live in the deep open ocean, down to depths from 4,000 meters to as deep as 7,000 meters, making this group the deepest known octopuses in the world. And because of this, Dumbo octopuses have some very interesting adaptations. Life at these extreme depths requires the ability to live in very cold water and in the complete absence of sunlight. Apart from that, the water is very heavy. So animals that live that deep need to be adapted to extreme pressures, and one of the most common adaptations to deal with this pressure is a gelatinous body. Found at depths reaching anywhere from 1,000 to 7,000 meters, it's one of the deepest dwelling octopuses known to man. That's right. This little fellow calls the crushing pressures and frigid temperatures of the abyssal and hadal zones home. Unique among octopuses, Dumbos don't have an ink sac. They've adapted to their environment by becoming virtually transparent, making them nearly invisible to predators. Since food sources are scarce, these creatures can't afford to have finicky appetite. This fascinating octopus feeds on snails, worms, and other creatures that it hoovers up from the seafloor. Isn't it fascinating how these creatures adapt to life in the deep? Coming in at number three, we encounter the legendary giant squid. This creature is truly one of the ocean's most awe-inspiring inhabitants, a testament to the wonders that lie hidden beneath the sea's surface. This huge squid is called colossal squid and is the heaviest species of squid and the second largest to exist. They may weigh up to 600 kilograms and can get as long as 14 meters. They have the largest eyes of any known animal, with a diameter of up to 30 centimeters, allowing them to see in the low light conditions of the deep ocean. Each colossal squid's eye is also equipped with a light emitting organ, known as photophore, which they use like headlights to see in the dark. Due to their remote habitat and elusive nature, only a few specimens of the colossal squid have ever been captured or studied, making it one of the least understood creatures of the deep ocean. The giant squid known scientifically as Akatuthis ducks, is a deep ocean-dwelling squid that has long captivated our imaginations with tales of sea monsters and krakens. This elusive creature is not a figment of folklore, but a living, breathing marvel making its home in the darkest depths of the ocean. These colossal beings can grow up to 43 feet long for females and 33 feet for males, making them one of the largest known species of squid on the planet. The giant squid's size isn't its only impressive feature though. Each of its eight arms and two longer feeding tentacles are lined with hundreds of suction cups, each ringed with sharp, chitinous teeth. These formidable appendages are used to capture prey and to battle against predators in the deep. Imagine, if you will, the dark, cold environment of the ocean's abyssal zone, over 12,000 feet below the surface. 
A razor-sharp cutting beak. And a relentless drive to consume. It's a legendary sailor's curse. The ravenous kraken. A mythical creature able to rip apart ocean vessels with sheer brute force. These legends may have been inspired by giant or colossal squid, huge beasts that roam the depths of the ocean and are rarely sighted. It is here that the giant squid makes its home, in an environment where sunlight cannot penetrate and where the pressure is over a thousand times greater than at sea level. It's a world that's alien to us. Yet it's the perfect habitat for these magnificent creatures. Despite their size and formidable nature, giant squids aren't the monsters they're often made out to be. They're elusive and solitary, spending much of their lives hidden in the ocean's unseen depths. It's only in recent years that scientists have been able to study these creatures in their natural habitat, adding to the air of mystery and fascination that surrounds them. Okay, I'm not going to waste any time. <laughs> Because you can already see it, but... Oh, okay. This was at a place called the Moat Marine Laboratory. And... I, okay, so I'm gonna walk you... I'm gonna walk you through this. Because I thought it was gonna be an aquarium. I thought it was gonna become some kind of aquarium. I was excited to see what they had. Mm -hmm. Yeah, one thing I was not expecting was a... <laughs> was a perfectly preserved or beautifully preserved real almost fully grown giant squid like a legitimate a real for real giant squid a lot of size estimates and other things we know about the colossal squid comes actually from colossal squid beaks found inside the stomachs of sperm whales so there you have it the giant squid a creature that embodies the mystery and grandeur of the deep sea. An animal that reminds us of the wonders and secrets that our oceans hold, waiting to be discovered. The ocean depths are full of surprises, aren't they? At number two, we have a creature straight out of a horror movie, the anglerfish. The Bathiel Zone, also known as the Midnight Zone, because no sunlight ever reaches it begins 3,300 feet beneath the surface of the ocean. This is the hunting ground of the anglerfish. They attract prey with a lantern-like light that dangles from their heads, powered by bacteria. We do know that anglerfish can grow up to about three feet in size, like what we see in the video. And these creatures are hairy. The anglerfish is covered in hundreds of sensitive strand-like antenna, which allows them to detect the movement of prey in the pitch-black world they inhabit. This beast is notorious for its menacing appearance and the chilling depths at which it resides. Typically found at bone-crushing pressures of the abyssal zone between 3,000 and 6,000 meters deep, the anglerfish is a master of survival in one of the harshest environments on the planet. Its most distinctive feature is the luminescent organ known as the esca that dangles from a stalk on top of its head, acting as a lure for unsuspecting prey in the pitch black depths. Have you ever wondered how the anglerfish's bioluminescent glow works? This incredible fish lives in the dark, mysterious depths of the ocean, where sunlight can't reach. Living in the deep sea isn't easy, but the anglerfish has incredible adaptations to thrive in this harsh environment. The most eye-catching feature is its bioluminescent lure, hanging like a glowing fishing rod in front of its mouth. This glow is produced by special bacteria in its lure. These tiny organisms emit light through a chemical reaction with oxygen oxygen, resulting in a mesmerizing display. With this special trick, the anglerfish attracts curious little fish swimming in the dark, thinking it's a tasty treat or a potential mate. And then, the anglerfish strikes with lightning speed, snapping up its unsuspecting prey in an instant. Despite its intimidating appearance and ruthless hunting skills, the anglerfish plays a crucial role in maintaining the balance of the deep sea ecosystem, helping to keep the food chain in check and ensure the survival of other other marine species. This bizarre adaptation is a testament to the anglerfish's ingenuity and resilience. Equipped with a mouthful of razor-sharp teeth and a stomach that can expand to twice its size, 
this creature is a formidable predator, capable of swallowing prey up to twice its own size. This is one of the scariest, but also the most fascinating fish in the ocean. Meet the anglerfish, the deep sea nightmare. There are more than 200 species of anglerfish, in the order Lophiaforms, and they get their name, for their method of fishing their prey, by luring them, using fishing rod-like appendages, which are modified luminescent fin rays. At the end of the rod, is a sack of bioluminescent bacteria, that glows brightly in the dark, which is effective to lure their prey. Since there is no light in the deep sea, and once an unsuspecting prey swims too close, they strike with their mouth, full of long fang-like teeth. Aside from their appearance, anglerfish have one of the most bizarre mating processes, with some male species, literally becoming one with their partners, so their skin and blood vessels join together. This way, the male can get all the nutrients he needs from the female, to stay alive, so he can provide sperm, whenever she's ready to spawn. Just when you thought it couldn't get any more bizarre, we have our number one spot. These are the fastest fish jaws in the ocean. 10 feet per second. So fast it can only be seen in slow motion. Only the goblin has a jaw that whips forward like a slingshot. An ancient weapon that works, even today. And finally, at number one, we present the Goblin Shark, a creature that truly embodies the mysteries of the deep. This shark has been living in the deep ocean, relatively unchanged, for over 125 million years. The Goblin Shark has pink skin and a very distinct profile that features an elongated, flattened snout. It has jutting jaws filled with nail-like teeth. Goblin sharks have wrinkled, translucent skin, and it's their blood that gives them a murky, pink, or purplish-gray tinge. The species is found in marine waters near the seafloor up to 1,200 meters deep. Along with its heartbeat-detecting snout, the goblin shark has rapidly extendable jaws that attach to an expandable, muscular mouth and throat. They seem to have small fins, weak skeletons, and poorly developed muscular and visual systems. As with so many creatures of the deep, what we know about the goblin shark comes mostly down to the dead specimens and scant footage. There are still plenty of secrets to be discovered about this elusive, deep water shark. Unraveling the enigma of the goblin shark, it's like opening a book filled with tales of ancient sea monsters. This shark is a living fossil, its lineage dating back some 125 million years. Its most striking feature, the elongated flat snout, is an adaptation that has stood the test of time. This peculiar proboscis is packed with sensory organs that help the goblin shark detect its prey in the abyssal darkness. And let's not forget its jaw. Oh, the jaw, it's something straight out of a horror movie. When the goblin shark opens its mouth, its jaw juts out in an almost unnatural manner, extending to snatch up its unsuspecting prey with its long, needle-like teeth. It's a sight that would make even the bravest of divers shudder. The goblin shark's complexion is another marvel. Its skin lacks the typical shark-like gray. Instead, it's a startling pink. This pink hue is due to the blood vessel showing through its semi-transparent skin. It's a ghostly sight indeed. Now where does one encounter such a creature? The goblin shark is a resident of the deep sea, typically found at depths of over 3,000 feet. However, some have been discovered at astonishing depths of over 4,300 feet. It's a creature that truly calls the abyss its home. The goblin shark, like many deep sea dwellers, remains largely a mystery. Its rarity and the extreme depths at which it lives make it a difficult subject to study. But every encounter with this prehistoric predator provides valuable insights into a world that is vastly unexplored and teeming with life. The ocean depths are a world of their own, filled with creatures that are stranger than fiction. It's a reminder that our planet still holds many secrets waiting to be discovered. <laughs>